Gal Gadot, who is set to play the evil witch in Disney's live-action Snow White, has confirmed it took four hours to apply her character's makeup effects. The model and actress, Gadot was crowned Miss Israel at age 18 in 2004 and later set her sights on breaking into acting. After missing out on a role in the 2008 James Bond film Quantum of Solace, she was later cast in her first international film in 2009's Fast and Furious. However, it would be her casting in the role of Diana of Themyscira, Aka Wonder Woman, in the DC Extended Universe that would eventually turn her into a household name. Late last year it was announced that Gadot would be tackling the role of the Evil Queen in Disney's live-action reimagining of their classic animated film Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. Also set to star West Side Stories Rachel Ziegler in the titular role, principal photography on the production wrapped in July this year. While footage from the film was shown to attendees at this year's D23 Expo, the final film is not expected to arrive in theaters until 2024. Most recently, Gadot and Ziegler spoke with Variety during D23 and Gadot admitted that the pair did not get a chance to see the clip that was revealed to attendees. She did, however, express her enthusiasm for getting the opportunity to play the old hag, which involved actual prosthetic effects that took four hours in the makeup chair to apply. Check out their comments below, fans of the original animated film will recall the scene in which the evil witch transforms herself into an old hag in order to trick Snow White into eating a poisoned apple. Rather than relying on CGI, or some other form of digital wizardry, Gadot's comments reveal that director Mark Webb has chosen to rely on more traditional practical effects in order to bring that portion of the film to life. While the reliance on motion capture performance and digital effects is an increasingly commonplace practice in big-budget productions, the best results still often come from the more tried and tested practical methods such as the use of prosthetics. As for Gadot herself, the role of the Evil Queen is a significant departure from other characters that audiences are used to seeing her play. Moving from an empowered superhero to one of Disney's most famous villains marks an interesting change for the actress, who is also set to portray the famed Egyptian queen Cleopatra in an upcoming biopic. Meanwhile, Fans of Gadot will likely be keeping an eye out for their own first glimpse of her as the Evil Queen ahead of the wait until Snow White's 2024 release date. Source, Variety.